Hey, welcome back for another Trick Tip Tuesday. And today I'm gonna to be talking about our lubrication products that we have for bending and also for uh, notching and cutting. So um, these are some of the different sizes of our uh, bending lube that we have. And uh, the great part about this stuff here is that obviously, you know, when you're bending, you can use different oils, uh, W40, uh, you know, different oil products. Even some people that use uh, even regular motor oil and that sort of thing. Um, but the great part about this stuff is that this here uh, provides the lubrication you need, uh, you know, to be able to allow your part to slide through the bender um, without um, your dyes marring your tubing or anything like that. And that really uh, helps uh, lubricate the bend process. Um, but the great part about this stuff here is that it's water soluble. So when you're done bending, uh, easily wipes off with a rag and you can, uh, you can clean it off without any oily residue on your part when you're done. So, uh, and then if you do need to wipe it off, you can take a wet rag uh, with just some water on it, wipe it off, uh, and it will um, remove the, uh, the bending lube without, uh, like I said, leaving any oily residue. So, um, you know, if you're using it on a bender, basically you want to take and uh, just apply some to the areas, uh, you know, on your counter die and then even on your, uh, your main die where the tube is gonna need to uh, slide into your part or in, into your uh, die. So um, once you have that, you can slide your part into your bender. And then it's going to, uh, like I said, provide that protection you need to, uh, to keep the, the tubing um, nice and clean without any marks on it. And uh, it's also gonna help your dies last longer, uh, especially your counter dies where all the pressure is being applied uh, to bend your part. So, um, just do a little bend there. And as you can see, you got a little bit of that on your tube. And just take a rag, you can wipe it right off of there and it doesn't leave an oily residue on your part uh, that you need to come clean off with some type of cleaner or whatever. So um, it's water soluble, makes it real nice for being able to bend your tubing. So. All right, so here we have our notching and cutting oil. Uh, and it's great for um, if you're doing hole saw notching, um, you know, on your hole saw notcher or by hand, uh, whether you run it in a drill. Um, or if you have a drill press, uh, any other type of uh, drilling you're gonna be doing, drill bits, uh, it works really great for um, cooling the cutting temperatures uh, of your uh, hole saws, of your drill bits, uh, to be able to extend the life um, of your tooling. And then, um, again, this stuff is water soluble, so when it's done, you can wipe it off your part with a rag, and it's not going to leave that oily residue uh, that you need to clean off with uh, some other type of solvent. So. Um, check out our um, notching and cutting lube on our website, also our bending lube. We have different sizes available from these small bottles uh, all the way up to um, five gallon drums, uh, even 55 gallon drums. So um, check out those different products, uh, see what would fit for you. And uh, thanks for watching this week's Trick Tip Tuesday, and we'll see you next week.